Alrighty, what's happening, tubers? Bit of a random one, and I forgot to open my gate. Damn. Um, it's I think it's the thirtieth of the twelfth here in Brisbane, Australia. Um, I'm supposed to be working today, but I haven't had much work on today and yesterday, and I've been weaving my workshop around. So I thought I'd stop in for a bit of a chat if anybody was keen. Um, it's a very very random one. If you ask any questions. Later, ask them in the questions below after this is finished and I'll try and answer them. Um, I'm a bit behind in all my comments and stuff like that, but life gets in the way, I guess. So, um, is the chat working? The chat's working. Is anybody in the chat? Seven viewers. There we go. The chat's starting to come. Number three. Ah. Gonna make that bigger so I can actually see pop out chat. My eyes are gone to shit, eh? I, just, I can't see much lately anymore. No, the chat's not working. Seems to be it. Seems to be now. What's going on in your part of the world? Where are you from? I really don't have a topic for this live feed. It's just something to catch up, chat, you know. Get to know people. Welcome, Gerard from the UK. Belgium, slow, nothing going on. Good afternoon from South Carolina. Are you into e-bikes? No, I never had. My dog's going nuts. Sure as shit, all day yesterday I didn't have a single job to do, not a single phone call, and I bet you today, just because I've gone live, I'm going to get some customers in. Um, England, are you into e-bikes? No, not really. Never ridden one. Wouldn't mind it though, wouldn't be so bad. Full lockdown, we're lucky here, we don't have full lockdown, it's sort of, the, the state's locked down, but nothing much. Ross, hey Brisbane Northside, hey buddy. Neighbour practically, he runs in on the chat. <laughs> uh, we just got offered gigabit internet here too which I might take them up on. If I get some gigabit internet, I might do some more live feeds because I think it'll be much more real time and might make it, uh, what's this one? A little bit better experience. Um, what's the time over there? It is 8.30. I technically open at 9. Oz, Preda, oi, 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 Pete, Mike. Hey, Mike. Sorry, I was going to let you know that I was going to do a live feed, but... I was going to do a live feed with the battery analyzer because I'm still mucking around with that. Um, but I'll just do that off camera, I decided. I definitely recommend you to get a $200 e-bike kit. Will that go on a mini? <laughs> no, I sold my I sold my mountain bike because I blew out my left knee. I walk, I walk right now and my left knee, you can in the mornings you can hear the fluid go from the front of my knee to the back of my knee as I walk. Yeah, it's not much fun. So I don't have a mountain bike anymore. I sold it for the same price I bought it for, which I was pretty happy with. Um, I have some 26650s I need to build a pack. Where should I get the nickel and spot welder from? If you're local, you can borrow the spot welder from me. It is currently not out on um, loan at the moment community spot welder and all that. James says I won't make any difference. Paul Turner, hey Pete. Um, about time you surfaced, Pete. I've been here. I've been on the Facebooks. I've been on the forum. I'm still here. That's actually my, the cars. I got another car. Well, the wife got another car. She got a mini as well because she got sick of me waiting. I wanted to have my mini electric and on the road um, in one day's time. 
reality of it is it's still sitting there without wheels and subframes and engine bay hasn't been painted. That many. I had good intentions, but to be fair, I didn't get very many YouTube views either, so it was like, eh, you get, you get disappointed, you get disheartened. It's disheartening with YouTube, you get heaps of views and then you get no views and it's just like, meh. Um, about time you surface, good day Pete. Have you been working on your car? Yes, how much? Um, I don't do Facebook, Zuckerberg. <laughs> Minus one knee, yeah. Look, I, I'm not proud of the fact, but I think I just went out too hard, too fast. I went up every couple of days. I was doing 15, 20 kilometer round trips up mountains and 45 year old body, probably not the smartest thing. It'll be, it'll be right. It's starting to get better now. About a year later, it's, um, I haven't ridden for over a year. Um, about a year later, it, it's fine. You can you can still feel it. You, you're still aware that you have a kneecap and that's something wrong with it, but it's it's fine. It doesn't slow me down too much. Wind here in the UK getting solar as good time sucks. How much power are you pumping out, Pete? Um, well, it, it's been cloudy here. We've had lots and lots of cloudy days, so my solar hasn't been anything special and i've got a few problems with a few of my batteries that i haven't sorted out um it's not that i don't want to sort them out it's just i don't want to sort them out um yeah cloudy days if i do that and i think if i hit that button that'll do something so you can see there, you can see I get 40 kilowatt hours some days. This is just the grid tide. This is so my um, my five kilowatt solar inverter. Um, so you get 40 kilowatt hours some days and it goes down to seven kilowatts. But that's only 6,000 watts of panels and I've got another eight kilowatt of panels, 8,000 watts of panels on the off grid side as well. So. I can't really add them up because the off-grid side, if I use it during the day, I, I really have no idea. Um, and I'm looking at the wrong camera. Why am I looking at the wrong camera? Logitech. That one? Cancel. No, that didn't work. I broke it. I broke that one too. Why is that one not working? Logitech. Something's not right. Something's not right with me little stream deck. Anyways, that's where my solar is. Um, I don't do Google either, apart from YouTube. Sadly, there's no avoiding it. Yeah, I've given up trying to hide stuff. You just don't put anything on there. You don't want them to see. Um, Madrid, Spain. Welcome, sir. Kyle, I hear you... I hear you on that. Uh, you screwed the pitch with your knee. Better do rehab. No, I don't. I don't do doctors. Um, I don't do doctors. Doctors piss me off. They just—it's just money, 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 money. Oh, we got to go and see a specialist. Oh, your specialist sends you back to the other doctor, and they just keep—they just keep giving each other money. No, I don't do doctors. Fuck that. Uh, case in point, I went to get my ears tested, and I walked into the doc. And I walked into the doctor, and I said, "I've got tinnitus. I want to stop the tinnitus, but I've only got twenty percent hearing in my ear." And the doctor said, "Oh, you have to go and see an audiologist." Went to see the audiologist, got a test done. The audiologist wouldn't give me the test results. I had to go back to the doctor, so it was like eighty or hundred bucks each time. I got to the doctor. The doctor said, "Oh, you've got twenty percent hearing in that ear," and I said, "No fucking shit. What about the tinnitus?" And he says, oh, we better send you back to the audiologist again. Different test went back. He says, oh, you've got tinnitus, and there's nothing we can do to help that. That'll be another $80, thanks. And I thought, you doctors, and I haven't been back since. That was 10, 12 years ago. They just want money, and, they, and none, of them, none of them have any um, respect for the work, like um, responsibility for what they're doing. They try to try, pass your buck off to everyone else. We got snow here in Sheffield. Snow sucks. 
have you seen you have not seen snow yet no I haven't seen snow you've been around for a while Peter um, I need to power 3,000 watts of grow lights how many watts and panels do you think I need um, 3,000 watts of grow lights I'd have to maths that but it'd be a lot probably 10 15 kilowatt out kilowatt off panels because you still got to charge your batteries during the day and then you can only count on 60% efficiency of the solar panels for 90% of the time. How would you recommend starting off creating a power bank? Um, not using 18650s, going to a larger format, or using EV batteries. Um, that is the way everyone seems to be going now. And to be honest, like, that's a terrible view. Um, to be honest, where is that one? That is not what I wanted to show you that one um, you have a look at my batteries and I've still got one I've still got two there that keep dropping so cell 50 uh, 45 is 3.84 and this one here is 3.82 and they keep dropping they I have to keep balance charging those two because um, just, they've just got issues there's no heat or anything there that I can detect but honestly if, you, if you're going to do it, I mean, if you've got the time, do EV battery, uh, do do it this way, but otherwise, I wouldn't do it again. And I know that sucks with, like, the entire community, but I've been doing it long enough now to make that call. Um, don't get me wrong, they work, and they work really, really, really well, my batteries. They work staggeringly well. It's just... I don't know, maybe I'm just done with it because I've done so much of it, so I'm a bit a bit disheartened. Uh, DuckDuckGo is just as good uh, in Brave instead of Coma. Do your own rehab. Doctors have no duty of care these days. That's the word I was looking for, duty of care. I'll have to run down in 10 seconds or something and go and open this gate. Um... Hey, Peter, will battery hash make a standalone system? Will battery hash make a standalone system for a rig? No. Battery hash is dead. Actually, I had my battery hash t shirt on until yesterday. Um, I've got to go and open the gate. My wife's home. Give me a minute. I'll be back. Nobody run away and nobody say boobs. I'm going to open it anyway. coming back that was exciting does anybody like my new workshop layout boobs got blocked haha -ha. uh, my new workshop layout basically what I've done is this bench was sort of over here and I'm making all of that side over that side I'm bringing everything over this side condensing it all down and then turning that side into a mini workshop so I can work on my cars um, during the day. Um, yeah, work on my cars during the day when I haven't got computer work to do, or as it turns out. Um, what do you call it? Consoles. Jimmy B, Brisbane, how's, it do, uh, how's your boy doing? They're, they're going all right. Sheffield. Uh, yes, it's Average Joe's T-shirt. You can buy it in the link. I have no idea where. Um, two from Sheffield. Don't know what you're talking about there, sorry. I don't know for sure, but if they international shipping, but big uh, batteryhookup.com is awesome. Yeah, they don't do international. T well, they do, actually, but postage is, is terrible. Um, 
iconic it says battery at the top right hand of the screen i <laughs> I was going to knock that out, but I wanted I wanted the field of view on the GoPro. But look at look, 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 look at this. There, oh where are we? So that bench over there that says mobile phone repairs, that's Ed's bench. That's coming over here. And then which way? And I've cleaned up all that, so Ed's bench is coming onto the right hand wall. And then my bench is here, and I've cleaned up cleaned up everything. I've got all my PlayStations and Xboxes and all my parts underneath there. So in the last four days I've put actually a lot of effort into cleaning up and trying to get the, the workshop um, more efficient I guess you'd say. I'm still, I'm going to unplug that. I'm still really liking this little battery analyzer too. I know I haven't done a review on it guys yet but Oh, I want to stop doing reviews and stuff unless I've used it, um, especially for stuff I get given for free. But that is still going really, really well. I've had to label some of the things because I keep putting it in and out. And I've put about 50 batteries through it, I think, so far, and it's still going strong. Um, I was going to have that all set up, but that would have been fake because I wasn't actually using it because I've been moving around the workshop. Uh, hello from Racing... Wisconsin, Wisconsin. Uh, nice bench setup. Thank you very much. I try iconic. Beat the top right hand screen. I have a small four kilowatt pack now. What's the best way to collect cells for a DIY wall? Uh, relentlessly. <laughs> Get a mic. Buy them off Mike. Mike's got heaps in the US and he's selling them cheap and they're tested. All you got to do is build packs. It'll be so fast. Hey Mike, drop a link in the in the um, in the in the description below, so to speak. QS Tech Service, nice um, bench setup. Yes, that's oh yeah, okay. I know who you are now. Yeah, it's getting there. So it's nice and neat and works. And that's what I got for Christmas. I got the Ryobi. I got the Ryobi thing for Christmas. So keep all that a little bit neater and tidier as well, which. I thought was a very thoughtful gift from my wife. I bought her a $15,000 car, she bought me a $150 box. Seems fair, right? Wayne, good morning, sir. Uh, I'm going to make a video on easy way to open modem batteries. What would you consider giving? Would you consider be giving me a shot if you like it? Sure. Um, although I must admit, the amount of battery videos that I watch are horrendously limited. I don't watch too many battery channels anymore. Um, I still sort of frequent Jehu every now and again when he produces something. Um, but it's sort of... I've, 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 I've moved on. It's mini videos, B videos, and um, Northridge Fix, Lewis Rosman... Um, and, and the like doing repair videos and stuff. I'm trying to trying to do my day job better, I guess you'd say. Faster, more efficiently, cleaner. Uh, I just got a big order from Battery Hookup. I hope you use my affiliate code. I make 10% of all sales and you save 5%. Um, power walls, it is always much appreciated. And if I can make a hundred, a couple of hundred bucks a month out of that, that is all, always helps. Ryobi rules. I agree. I've had no no qualms with the Ryobi gear. I've never had anything Ryobi break. Um, I'll be mourning the loss of battery hash. <laughs> I thought the guy was brilliant. Yeah, he's all right, but on oh, battery hash, I like only yesterday. Yesterday I pulled apart battery hash up, and I started getting it going again. But I've only got one card left. But you know what? With the battery hasher, and I can honestly say, because I can walk around and pick it all up right now, Ugh. and I just put a power supply back in this yesterday. That's the old battery hasher rig. And the, the DC power supply that I had with it, the DC to DC, that's still going. Um, and I'm actually, I don't know whether I'm shocked or, or what, but that's still running after many many years of work well not constant work but you know it's still it's still done a lot and i got one out of the farm now too i need to do a farm update because we've got 
a year ago I put extra batteries out there and I changed um, the water pump stuff and I've done a little bit of stuff out at the farm but I've got three beehives out at the farm now as well. I should do a video on that. Um, where am I up to? Mike, drop a link. I don't think Mike's still here. He's probably in and out. He's probably working. Thanks, really love your videos. Uh, you're a great man. Hope you have a happy holidays. Yeah, have holidays. I've been spent out here working, trying to earn a living, and changing my shit around. I haven't taken. I haven't really taken a holiday for a very long time. Probably ten years. Uh, what's the best source in, um, for batteries in Brisbane? Preferably a form factor. Um, I haven't seen, Jimmy, in Brisbane, I haven't seen any cells for sale for quite some time. I'm still looking for cells because I still look for cells so I can buy them cheap and sell them at a profit. Because, let's face it, you know, life. Um, but there isn't too many there. I've gotten heaps of people wanting to sponsor me and bring in shipping containers worth of batteries. And it's like it all falls through. It's just, it's too hard when you come to Australia. Just use, um, what's his name over in Western Australia? Uh, lithium, lithium power. And buy a Tesla battery from him. Um, two grips, big channel locks for the lithium batteries. Oh, okay. That'll work. Is it better to solder or spot weld your 18650s? It is much better um, to spot weld. But if you don't have a spot welder, use a soldering iron and keep the heat, keep as much heat out of it as you can. Uh, Sagusi, I'm very sorry about the pronunciation about that. Um, thank you, sir. Yes, farm update. Yes, I might even go at the farm today. I have got a bunch of footage for the farm, but um, hey, bud, just ordered my first electric car. Ford Mac A, awesome Dylan. Uh, Link, there we go. Mike is here and he's listening. What does it say possible to go off grid? Is that me going off grid or anybody going off grid? Um, oh, I charges. A W E S O M E. Um, I charges coming back today, which is good because then I can test the um, the lithium battery. Lithium battery is still on the light because it actually works really well for that. And actually, I would buy one just for the low drain devices that need to go for hours and hours. Um, hey, bud, just ordered my first electric car. Would you say it's possible to go off grid? Um, yeah, sorry. For me to go off grid, um, no. It's far too cheap to be connected to the grid when you can as a backup. For $1.20 a day, I never have to worry about a generator. Um, I never have to worry about saving electricity or anything. I mean, for the last two months, I've been trying really, really hard um, to save as much energy as possible, but it's sort of in the last, sorry, for the last three months, sort of trying. But the last two weeks it's been hot, so air conditioners run 24 hours a day. Um, and it's just too easy to use grid power. I mean, hell, it's comfortable and you can be happy, so, yeah. What's with the bees being up to lots of honey, lots and lots and lots of honey? We were selling for $15 a kilo because there wasn't too much honey around, and now there's so much honey for sale um, that we can't even sell it. So if anybody wants honey... Um, if anybody wants honey, probably next weekend, I think I'll probably have 30 kilos of honey. I might even do some honeycomb this time. And also, if anybody wants the community spot welder, it's available. Um, hey Pete, do you know anything similar to bigger op open front mini box .com, eh? It's a small UPS up to 24 volt. Oh, I've never even heard of it. Sorry, buddy. Um, is your container set up all finished? Um, the container set up. We should probably talk about the container. Um, it's full of mini parts. 
because I had to clean out this shed and I needed somewhere to put it and the shipping container won. So I had a, um, a solar installer come out. Um, I paid him a hundred bucks to drive out here, have a look at everything. He's a qualified solar installer or battery technician, whatever else. Um, he got up on the roof, had a look at everything, took some measurements and all that sort of stuff. And then ghosted me, just fucking refused out, just just didn't refer my calls or anything, didn't provide a quote. Um, so the shipping container, sort of the idea went south. And then COVID hit. I think that's about the same time that COVID hit. So I, did, I was unsure about money, so it got redirected to other places, a mini. Um, <laughs> so the shipping container project, although that isn't dead, it's it's on life support. Because I got to pay a whole heap of contractors to do a whole heap of stuff that I used to be able to do for free, so it's like, uh, um, yeah. So, why did you have to bring that up to Saw Point after moving that damn thing into place? Remember, 15s is best. Um, it's 15s is best when you know you got a inverter that actually runs 15s and you can charge and discharge and get it into the into the peak slot and not blow your inverter up until then it's 14s for me uh, so it is illegal for me to sh just ship batteries depending on where you are and what the legal requirements are is hot glue a good way to isolate battery product pinouts um, I wouldn't because I mean uh, the simplest short circuit or getting it hot would actually um, Melt the hot glue. Wifey wants to know why you poured with um, Mike. Um, I'm bored with batteries because I've been doing it for a friggin' long time, and I don't, I don't want to be the. And I know Mike does this. I don't want to be the YouTuber that builds something without a purpose. Um. There are only a handful of times I've built something for the sake of building something for a YouTube video. I never want to build something and have it sitting in the corner. Wait a minute, there's a grey box over there full of batteries I haven't done anything with. But you get the idea. Um, yes, yeah, so I don't want to be the YouTuber that, that doesn't have a purpose for their batteries. And I don't need any more batteries. So... Um, and the, the straight, new Australian laws, they're just, they're kicking my ass. They really are. Um, I am not seeing an option to put any other isolators there. Sorry, I have no idea what you're talking about, Zoran. Um, Wayne, how's the battery going today with absolutely horrible weather? It's fine. They're going all right. Um, it's cooler, so we're not um, running any... Um, air conditioning or anything for the last couple of days. So they're going good. Um, I keep saying arm, arm, arm because I don't know what I'm doing. Is it that one? That one. There we go. Why is that not working? So many issues. That one. I really should have set up Stream Deck. So that's my, that's my house battery. So we're getting hardly any solar. Had I have done that one, it would have been better. And then you can, and the kids are the kids are on their computers and stuff, so we're using seven hundred and seventy five watts. Uh, we are in battery mode, so we're using batteries with a little bit of well, battery discharge current. Yeah, so it's only just touching the batteries. There's not much solar at the moment, and it's nine o'clock in the morning. Um, batrium and that is my big inverter so the big inverter we're only doing 889 watts which means I'm not going to have any hot water today that's guaranteed and through the night we didn't have any air conditioning on um, I'm not sure what was using 400 watts there there's only 280 watts 228 watts something like that that's when we got the air conditioner on with the um, AC coupled inverter a air conditioner coming on and off um yeah so it's been some pretty shitty days come on load some data up there we go 
That's it, that's hitting it hard, 2,000 watts at night time. Uh, and then we've got, what else we got? That is that battery, and this is the shed battery. Where's the shed battery? Come on. Um, my shed battery's not working. I'm not actually surprised at that because I was messing around with it yesterday. Uh, I was changing all the wireless networks in my shed. So I probably forgot to put that one on. But there you go, there you go. That's how my batteries are going. The obligatory um, battery and battery. What else have we got? Hello, peeps. Uh, remember, 15S is the best uh, ship for batteries. Um, what have we got? We've got some horrible weather coming. Got some proper horrible weather coming. Um, oh, we got a super chat, and I only just saw it. Yep, uh, uh, off-grid sucks if you have a uh, high battery enough battery bank in generation on cloudy days. Um, can I come see you? Yes, you can. Just organise it. Work out where I am. Work out my phone number. Pick up the goddamn phone and call me. Don't message me. Don't send a blooming paper airplane with your phone number on it. Ask me to call you. Work out where I am and call me. And I mean, let's face it, it's not really hard if you're a genius. Um, what's your perspective on zero point energy? I have no freaking idea what zero point energy is. Make me a mod. No, I have plenty of mods. Sorry, QS Tech Service. I have, um, my moderation team is absolutely on point and I told them that they're never getting replaced. Um, Glenn, Lockie, Hey Pete, Rowan, Mike, Daniel and any other OGs on here. Um, and they're most of my mods. <laughs> Uh, more vids, dude. No, I don't have time to make more vids. Um, if I, I can't, I, I tried to make YouTube pay me money, um, and it went up and it went down. And to be honest, I need a, a regular income, not a guesswork income from YouTube. So YouTube is absolutely second these days. Day job is first. Um, but I'll still, I'll still keep doing stuff. I've still got stuff planned. Uh, the X6 will come back today, so I'm going to pull that lithium battery apart. And put a hundred um, cycles on that. I've got to put, um, I've got a self discharger in my big grey battery back there, and yeah, I have got, I've got a few videos planned, and I've got like five videos I think in production, but I don't spend much time on them. I really should because they're all filmed. I just need to edit them up. Um, how many packs can eighty six fifty can MPP solar handle? Well, it depends on which inverter you've got. Uh, Dave's Tech, um, Natalie's Girl, I have a bunch of, um, sorry, thank you for the super chat first of all, uh, I have a bunch of battery packs uh, that, with their own BMS, some lithium ion, some lithium ion phosphate, so don't mix them, uh, 10 to 40 amp hours, can I link those together on one bus bar for my inverter, no, don't do it don't mix chemistries because I mean they've got different charge curves they've got different char different discharge curves and I don't know what they are but don't do it it's crazy it's madness you'll burn something down stick to one uh, Jimmy B uh, view deleted message uh, he ghosted you because he can't just profit on parts you've already got too much shit bro what jimmy b you must be drunk um a bomb <laughs> inverter bomb um take that average joe <laughs> um how is the adm trolling uh battery going for your brother um funny story about that too that's one of those projects that was a really good idea at the time and it's down there and it's still like the trolling motor battery is still going um but it it never went on the water i'm not a water baby and it just just hear me out see these legs they don't swim very well and as soon as i see the sun as soon as i I walk past somewhere with direct sun, they turn this bright shade of pink. It's a very attractive shade of pink. 
But yeah, me and water. I never, I never. It was a good plan. It was a really good plan. And my brother even went because the video did so well. My brother even went and bought a different trolling motor so I could do another video on that and um, try and shift the focus of the the YouTube channel. But I don't like trolling motors, even though that video did really well. I don't I don't like fishing. I don't like swimming. I don't like the ocean. Not much anyway. So yeah. Funny story. Um, do you size your cells by the amount of amps using laptop batteries at 2.2 kilowatt? I'm thinking about per cell max charge. It would be. There's so there's so Christopher. There's so many questions there that I can't answer them. You've got to you've got to match your load and your charging and your discharging to your cells in anything you do. So just look at the, the specs on the cells and go backwards from there. How many packs of 18650 80 by 7 can MPPs hold it by 7? Okay, so it's a 7S. So you could put 200 packs, 500 packs, or 10,000 packs. It's not, the, it's not the amount of storage the MPP solar can handle. It's the voltage range. Um, are all your appliances stuffed all 220 volts? Yes, they certainly are. Holy heck, I'm behind. 75 people in the chat. Um, interesting story. Every time I do a live feed, I lose like... 10 or 20 subscribers and usually make about two dollars an hour <laughs> i was wrong on getting customers it's oh no it's just gone nine o'clock now so technically speaking i'm only um supposed to be open now uh wayne don't break my inverter that inverter's a beast and i haven't been able to kill it yet wayne uh, Wayne supplied me that little, um, well, actually, I borrowed it, and it's never gone back, which is kind of what I do. Um, wait a minute, Wayne. What's the name of it, Wayne? I've got to walk all the way around. K-R-X-N-Y. Wait a minute. Can you see me? K-R-X-N-Y. And that's that little 24-volt inverter that's running all the lights and a computer, and it's still working. I think, Wayne, that's been running for a year now I've had that, hasn't it? 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? I'd, ideally, I'd show you the battery for that, but it's not working. Or at least the wireless isn't working. Oh, no, it's working. Look, it works up here, just not down in the power shed. So that one's got a bad battery as well. No, that one. That's the shed battery. So this one, this one here, number two, is fairly weak, and it just just keeps dropping. So that's the self discharger as well. But it's going well. Um, I can't show you too much stuff with the Batrium. Actually, there's another. There's a release on the Batrium, public release on the Batrium software that a lot of you can get. Um, it's got some other cool stuff in it that hasn't really been public. And there's so much more cool stuff in the back end that you, uh, you guys are just going to want to love to see. Um, these two, I don't even know where I'm up to. I'm so sorry. Average average watch time is 3.5 minutes. What's going on? Am I really that boring? That's terrifying. We should try and bump that up a little bit to at least maybe 3.5 minutes average watch time. Get my tits out or something. Oh, we, then we lost one. Just as I said it, we lost one. That's terrifying. Um, this isn't this isn't a very good live feed. Um, there you go. Have you found out what kind of cells that were used in that knockoff Ryobi pack? Seems to me like two thousand milliamp hour generic or Chinese cells. Um. I, I would I would have to say that that is the case, um, but I have to, I can't I had lots of complaints saying it was a biased review and something and stuff but 
you guys, you guys know me. I try, I try not to be biased. I mean, I might have come across like that, but remembering I had those Vanon batteries, and they would, they just ripped me off. Um, and I can't see how this company would be any better, if I should be honest. Uh, give me a second. I've got to grab that because you know work. Oh, okay, yeah. So a PlayStation 4 HDMI port. Um, I could probably do that while you wait today because I don't have... I could probably do that while you wait. Um, yeah, and it's 90 bucks. And it's 90 bucks. Is it a PlayStation 4 Slim Pro? Oh, okay, Slim. Okay, yeah. Yeah, drop it off. I'll get it done. When... I don't know, half an hour or something. Whereabouts are you coming from? Whereabouts are you? Oh, okay, and when do you want to pop over? Okay, head on over and I... Sh okay, cheers, thank you. Bye. I have a job coming in. Get in! Is my mic... Yeah, my mic is working. Um, I have a PlayStation 4 coming in for HDMI port. I wonder if I should do that live. Not really, because I don't have any cameras on that side of the bench set up. Um, where I'm up to, I'm going to start doing what, and sorry, this is because i just ignoring the chat. I do apologize. I'm going to try and start doing live feeds uh, for my Patreons, past and present. I don't know how I contact my past, but anyway. Um, and I'm going to try and leave my webcam running during the day. So if my Patreon members, and there's not, there's about 20 of them or something, um, want to chat throughout the day, they can. And, you know, just wander in and out. Hopefully I've got to be able to see it. It'd be good having it away where it was a two-way chat. Um, found out what kind of... Your camera got blurry. My camera got probably got blurry because my kids jumped on. Um... You're watching on my TV. <laughs> uh, help the lad out and smash that like button, folks. Absolutely. It's on. Uh, now you're referring to 7S80P. If so, you shouldn't do two of those to minimize current per cell. Um, I'm just going to. I I literally have no idea where I'm up to. Corey, I saw you were live and decided to come and say hi, but can't stay very long. Thank you, Corey. Corey's one of my main um, um, moderators on the forum. He does a shit ton of work over there. Is that laptop battery tester on the counter? Yes, Bart. It is friggin' brilliant. I love it. Um, and I will be trying to do some sort of a video with that. The problem is doing a video that somebody else hasn't already done, so I might just do a video of me using it. Um, and show you how practical it is. Um, if I had have had that, like years ago when I started doing my power wall, you could have used that device. I, I can't even remember the price. It's 200 bucks or something, USD. You could have used that, tested a bunch of cells, even if randomly, and if you found ones with low cycle counts, like 10, 20 cycles, you could sell them off as new and use that money to buy more recycled cells. And you'd, I reckon it wouldn't be difficult to actually self-fund your little recycling and your, your power wall build with one of those units. That's how, that's how good it is. Um, now, that said, I did do a, a Gumtree Facebook-type ad with it and said, free battery testing for your laptops. And I thought, what a great idea and what a great way of getting customers up my driveway and to give me money. Um, so I run that for one month, doing doing it free. So I'd, 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 the plan was the customer would come in, I'd plug it in and go, oh, you've got 700 cycles on that, I recommend you buy a new one. Um, or if it's only got 40 cycles and it's dead flat, I could have charged it back up again. 
and got it running for them again or whatever. And I would have done that for free. Um, hopefully I would have sold some new batteries out of it. The reality of that comment is I got not a single person in a month with thousands and thousands and thousands of clicks on the ad, um, but not a single person walked up the driveway, which is kind of odd. So I've only ever done my own batteries with it for now. Uh, but I, th there really has to be a way of monetizing that a lot better. But I thought give, giving it away was was brilliant, you know, and it didn't. It didn't work. So have you checked out the DIY BMS project? Just build a small test pack and working nicely. I also have Batrium on my main power, but DIY BMS has great for small pack. That's awesome. No, I haven't tested it out. Many people have said it's good. Um, but yeah, uh, and also a lot of people have said that it's not a commercial product. Um, so yeah. Uh, do, 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 um, hi Peter, I watch start to end and don't know about others. Uh, sounds like they're crazy. <laughs> Thank you very much, Peter. Um, yeah, so DIY messing is CAN bus, I think, really need for my dual sunny island that the Batrium gives. Uh, seven. DIY BMS works great for balancing the switching relays for open voltage. I don't disagree. In series, um, I'm lost with that whole conversation. At TDS, which is uh, basically what most people want, a BMS. Which is basically what most people want from a BMS. At least, it was what I would want. Um, what degree did you get from the unit? What do you mean, what degree did I get from the unit? John, welcome. Thank you very much for the emojis. Yes, but also a shunt. Shunt's important. Shunt trip is also important. But I'll oh, relay there. Yeah, that, that does that. Um, about the battery tester, I am working at a recycling plant and I'm trying to get laptop battery testing set up. The only laptop batteries um, packs don't allow to charge unless you uh, short circuit wires. Um, have you managed to test some Dell packs? I've tested heaps of batteries. Um, but and this, this is a very, very clever device in the fact that it does a lot of things that a lot of other units just can't do. Um, so, you're, so you're talking about um, Dell batteries and the like. I've tested a lot of Dell batteries. They all worked. Um, I've tested some Dell batteries with zero voltage. And this has the, the ability to inject voltage into the battery via the two leads and then still be able to read um, the little chip within the battery. So you could still read cycles um, and stuff like that. You can also set it to charge at 0 0.01 amps or something and really slowly charge a bad battery back up again. So if it's got low cells and it's just sat around for 10 years, sorry, low cycles, um, this has the ability to bring it back to life again. Um, I brought quite a few batteries back to life and I have I think I have three laptops um, collected now where they won't charge at all, but the battery's detected. So the plan is for the video is to get them going again. Um, I've also got a heap of these cells where I got all my batteries from. Um, and these are from Acer laptops, the all the NCR 18650s I got. <coughs> and they were able to read them. And I got all these uh, at like one volt. So I was able to charge a lot of them back up again, read them and stuff like that. But these all have like 500 cycles on them. Coming from a school, I am not surprised at all. But they still have great capacity, so win. Do you have a link for the laptop battery tester reader? No, Dave's Tech. I'm going to try, if I don't have too much work on today, I'm going to try and do that video today. Um, but I still need to make some money to pay the bills today. So, and on that note, once that, um, once the, the customer comes up for this job, I'll leave the, I'll leave the live feed running. You can still have a chat because that still helps the channel, but I'll get over there and I'll do that. Um, I'll try and keep, I'll keep her off camera and then get that done. And maybe you can see how long it takes to do that sort of a job from pull down to you know, talking shit to getting it done. So we might just throw that over there. And that's the laptop with the battery that's, or one of them with the battery that's bad. 
might clean this up a bit. The nose is driving me freaking crazy. Okay. Um, I was going to turn all my soldering irons on and stuff, try and be ready for it, but you know. Um, because I can't charge those Dell packs that don't accept charge. But when I hook them up to a laptop, it will receive a charge. So I suspect that Dell is doing something. That's usually just a pin out. Sometimes you've got to put an, uh, an extra earth in. Um, this has got like three grounds. So it's got three ground wires. And some batteries you only need one. And other, other batteries you actually need to connect the other two grounds up to get it to charge. So... Um, He's asking what university degree you have. Oh, none. None whatsoever. In fact, I failed everything since year eight. Everything. Maths, English, science, French. Nah, didn't learn that. I, I, I stuffed up my school. And my school years were just shit. I had, I had more fun running around chasing after girls, even though I wasn't at all successful with that. But I still did it. Um, and I did no work at school. So I have zero, I, I, I quite literally have zero education. Well, not literally, but, you know. I went to grade, I think I finished grade 11, but I failed 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11, and I never did grade 12. Um, prevents the charge. Through. You don't, you've, got, you've got to put other things there. Um, but... Hello, Pete. Can you please recommend a good spot welder? That's easy. www.diypowerwalls.com slash kworld. Um, uh, hello, Pete. Can you please recommend a good spot welder? Done that. Um, I know how that is. <laughs> Does it reset the chip? No, you can't reset the chip. You can it it doesn't do it doesn't change anything within the chip as far as i know i think they're working on that but it's not it's not something that's been completed they're also doing drone batteries they're um able to fix um i think dji drone batteries so they can repair them and charge them up again or rebalance them or something um there's a bunch of other stuff they're working on as well but unfortunately i have been busy and i haven't caught up with it They've got a couple of updates on the software as well. Uh, one of the good updates is you can actually enter in, um, actually, it wouldn't be hard. No, I'm, no, I'm not going to, I was just thinking I should, um, I should start it all up and do it, but that's not what I want to do. I actually want to do a zero effort live feed and I reckon I'm smashing that out of the park. And we're at the average view time of three minutes and 23 seconds. So we're getting there with a thousand playbacks. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna leave this live stream until one. I run out of bloody water. I was gonna say water, but that's almost out. Um until I got five thousand playbacks. You reckon that's doable? Uh fine um uh, Pete, I love your videos. You failed a lot of things I would have failed on. Failing's part of it. You don't learn shit unless you fuck something up. Um, I'm in the same boat. Did get my GED. What's the GED? Oh, that's like the equivalency, isn't it? Um, I love my K world. What's the best balancer for 18650s? It depends on how you want to balance and and what your use case is. If a hobby charger will balance, yes, man. K world is the best. All from Germany and stuff. Now for two and a half years. I reckon this K-Weld here has done 100,000 welds. I've got to mute you again. No, no saying to you. In that case, I would not be turning it back on again. 
Um, so can you conf yeah okay can have you have you flicked the safety switch back? Okay, and did the safety switch flick again? Okay, so, so well, I, w I would be considering trying to find out why that safety switch tripped. Is it a laptop or a desktop computer? Okay, so you probably find the power supply. Was it turned on at the time? The computer? Okay, so you've probably done a power supply or something. So, yeah. I'm not even going to quote a price because I don't even know what I've got in stock to do it. But I might be able to pop up there later, pick it up and bring it back here, unless you can bring it down here. Um, yeah, yeah. So um, it depends on what else has happened. I mean, if it's done a hard drive and stuff, which I doubt, usually it just does the power supply and you just change it out and away it goes again. But sometimes when it die, when it crashes, the hard drive's got to be repaired or you got to run disk, um, disk repair when you turn it back on again. But I don't think I don't, I don't think it's a deal breaker. I don't think it's going to be too bad. So if you can drop it up, I can get it done for you. Um, I think I've got one power supply in stock. I do. I have one power supply in stock. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now it is t look, look. That is completely typical of a power supply of a power supply um, failing in a computer. It's just a, a, just getting a little bit of a surge and says so see you later. So bring it up. We'll have a look. I mean, there's no use panic about it until we have a look and see what we can do. Are you right to bring it up, or do you want me to come and pick it up? I, you'd be quicker if you dropped it down, but I, I, I it'll be later on this afternoon before I can come pick it up. Yeah, and I and I mean if it's too if it's too much of a hassle, I can drop it back so you don't have to worry about all the cables and stuff. So that might might. Oh, you do? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh. Yeah, that's all right. So it might pay for me to drop it back. So if you drop it, you drop it up. I'll get it done, and then I'll drop it back. How's that? Awesome. No worries. It's the, the first the first one in the cul-de-sac. First house in the cul-de-sac. Num yeah, number one. Um, beside the car park. Beside the park. Beside the car park across the road from the school. No, um, don't, don't ask me what village it's in. I've only lived here for eight years. Um, That's preferable. Pants pan, pants and a shirt at the very minimum, please. I mean, I got cameras everywhere, and just no. <laughs> no. Okay. No worries. I'll sit. What what time are you planning on sort of heading around? Just so. What time are you thinking about popping up? Done. No worries. I'll see you in here. Okay, no worries, I'll see you in here. Cheers, bye. Oh. Thought you don't deliver, Pete. She's from a retirement village, come on. Um, oh, we went to 3.30. Ah, what else have we got? Um, help, help. 
I can't live without my PC. Um, telling him he's live on YouTube. Shh. I know that. Um, I didn't give out my bloody address on YouTube. And let's face it, I mean, you, you wouldn't have to be too friggin' bright to work out where I live. Uh, I just simply started charging everybody that walks up here unannounced 90 bucks. So you want to walk up here not unannounced, it's 90 bucks or bugger off. I think that's completely fair. Reset Digital Energy Solar Off Grid. Holy shit. That's one hell of a name. Um, have you ever had a fire accident? Why bad? No, never. Never even come. Uh, I've had big sparks. And I've tried to make fire. But no, I've never had nothing. No, nothing, um, nothing terrible. I've burnt, I've burnt lots of wires. I mean, but fire is different to um, choking smoke from wires melting so actual flames from a battery never never once several extremely large sparks <laughs> um burnt a wire pete lives in brisbane oh shit at least i hope i do um plane ticket deal Look, if you were coming to Brisbane, Australia, I'd waive the fee just so I didn't have to pay yours. No, Corey, you, you'd, you'd be welcome up here if it was I was pulling in my panties and walking around trying on bras. No. <laughs> um, don't you hate customers that turn you into their budgie smoker? <laughs> um, how much would you charge for it to... How much would you charge to fix an Xbox Series X? It depends on what's wrong with it. 150 bucks if it's any repair, um, and it's any repair that I can get done with used or second-hand parts. And or if it's a HDMI port for a Series X, it's 90 bucks, and I've already done one. Oh no, running from the building, fire no. <laughs> Come on, where's the freaking chat? Or did I, did I miss a whole heap of it when I was on the phone? Um... What else is there? Uh, you should be able to... watching this on HMI Smart. I tried watching this on HMI Smart TV. Uh, good, uh, good sounds, but just green screen. Had to switch back to cell phone. There we go. Um, what else have we got? I'm in the middle of the United States. I'm sure it's safe. Not going to show you. <laughs> Um, how do I contact for your repairs? You work out where I live and then you contact me. Um, chat, where are you, when are you buying some LIFO 4 prismatics? Um, when I have the next viral video. I skipped a little of the chat, I probably did. Um, they're fun. Have you got to put a screwdriver across the top and dead shorted them yet? I uh, love what you're doing, bro. Thank you very much. How's the mini going along? The mini's going good. We got another mini. Um, I'll do a video of the... I'll, I'll do some videos. I'll do some videos, okay? I promise, on the mini. Um, I have the motor. The petrol motor should be back from the... Um, what do you call it? The engine building place. Well, the machinist. So I've got the mini motor... I got the mini motor out and I thought, well, COVID's here. I don't know if I can afford to do electric and my other half really wanted to drive a mini around. So I um, spent two and a half thousand dollars on machine work on the block. Uh, the head, the crank, the rods had it bored to 80 thou over. So it's about, don't quote me, but it's about 1200 cc's the mini motor. So I took it from 1000 c, 1100 cc's to 1200 cc's. Um, very slight port and polish on the head, bigger valves, inlet and exhaust. Um, Cooper S valve guides because they've got a better collet. Uh, titanium retainers, double valve springs. Uh, standard, um, well flowing head, but it's been cleaned up a little bit, deburred. So, and a fast road cam. So that's being built. So that cost me about $6,000 in total. 
for all the parts and the block and the motor and all that sort of stuff. So that should be done. I'm going to video, I'm going to build the motor myself. I'm going to put it all together myself. So I'm going to video all that. Um, the interior is still in and still hasn't been started. So I'm going to go and pick that interior up and take it to a different trimmer. And then my wife got pissed off with waiting for me to finish my car. So she bought, well, I bought her a car for Christmas for her birthday. Um, a little mini. And more on that later. Unless you're on my Instagram. And Instagram has photos of that already. Um, hi, Pete. Thanks for all the hard work. When when you have spare time, haha, <laughs> I thought your vast knowledge into Amazon book. Um, I can't spell and I don't maths. So putting it on the Amazon book, I'd be willing to work with somebody on that. But as for actually doing it myself, it's never going to happen. I have talked to some people that have made done those books and they make a small fortune from them. Uh, it's just, I think the amount of effort that would go into it and the liability and stuff that you'd have that comes along with that wouldn't be my cup of tea. You missed heaps, Pete. That's fine. You can type it in again. Uh, have you ever checked the DC voltage on the Ryobi charger? I've seen it pulse on some voltages way over 6 volts on a cell. Never seen that, no. Now, now I'm going to have to check that. Um, I've got two chargers. So, um, okay, I'm going to have to, I'm not leaving, but I've got to go and get a message request. I've just got someone message me for a HDMI port to fix on the Xbox Series X. So that's another one, except I don't know which chat it's on might be my business one. I've just got to make sure that I'm not on my business one. Um, are you um, are you in the chat, Mike? Not Mike N. Mike, Mike, Mike. It re look, it really doesn't matter. It's 90 bucks if you're in the chat, dude. Um... But yeah, I can do that today. I've got all the stuff in stock for the, the Series X. Um, Wayne, just come and get them. Oh, geez, now everyone's messaging me. About, this is not the correct way to message me. Um, chat. Yes, you can, Wayne. Just come and get them. I've got green or... I've got grey or blue. I've got thousands of them. Um... Excuse me while I, I work and see if I can find inbox. Come on, open up. It's not that one. This is the problem with Facebook. It's not all in the same place. I've got chats freaking everywhere. Instagram. No, I do not want that. Go back to Facebook. HP Powerwall? Maybe it's on HP Powerwall? Chat. Where's the chat? Inbox. There we go. Oh, so, okay. So the same person messaged me twice, Mike. Uh, 90 bucks. 90 dollars. Can do it today. Mike, where do you live? Do you live? Radio. Put that over there so I can actually see it. Not you, Mike. The other Mike. The Mike that messaged me about a HDMI port on a Series X. Um, Life Pro 4 would make a good EV battery for the Mini. No, I've got to go Tesla Mini. Tesla, Tesla, Tesla. Lenovo battery packs. Pete's got the frizzle shizzle with the Modoc for his Mini. I don't know about frizzle shizzle. Um, 2K, it should be a solid engine. Don't get me wrong, it's not 2K, it's 6,500 Australian dineros. And that's with machine work, um, flat top pistons, the cam, um, brand new alternator, brand new starter motor, brand new clutch, brand new throw up bearings, brand new thrust, thrust bearings. 
uh, gearbox kit, um, gearbox linkage kit. Absolutely everything on the motor is new. Everything is on the motor is brand new, except for the nuts and bolts, which I actually want to replace with new ones. But I don't know how to do that. Um, so six and a half, not two. Um, I live in North Carolina. <laughs> yeah, to um, um, it's T R A L A, and I got the caps wrong. Yeah, that's not happening today. Um, do, do, do. How many 100 watt panels do I need? You need millions of them. Power the world. I have no reference to what you mean. I'm going to start my DIY wall power wall in a couple of months. Ah, oh, okay, there we go, Felix. Uh, it depends on how big you want to go and how much you want to charge. You can start with one 100 watt panel and start from there. Uh, bought 200 Lenovo packs. Most of them have red Sanyo cells inside. Do you realize? Did you also realize that they get hot? Yes, that's why we call them Sanyo heaters. Lots of them gets hot. Um, yes, get the bloody hot uh, red cell. <laughs> the pulse would be a zap to the dendrites and the batteries. I don't know. Do they have a desulfonator on a lithium battery? I'm not sure. Um, I'm hooking up 900 watts of sol 9,000 watts of solar in the middle of making my 18650 packs. I learned watching your channel. Now you tell me to go EV batteries. I'm saying I would go EV batteries. Done over, I would do EV batteries. But it's going to make for one really shitty YouTube series. And let's face it, I got a lot of in the early days. I got a lot of my cells for free. EV batteries are certainly not free, so that kind of doesn't work. Um, get rid of that chat. I really should be taking a more notice of what you guys are doing and not clicking around. Holy heck, I really shouldn't look at how much stuff I've missed on Facebook. Whoops, I do apologise about that. Um, text message. Uh, switch cartridge reader. A uh, Nintendo Switch cartridge reader. Um, uh, usually between $45 and $90. Because Surrey. Radio. Hot. Uh, is there a mic? Is there a mic in the house? Mike stands up. Mike. <laughs> So that concludes my check. <laughs> um, Salmon joke, by the way. And um, what the, Wayne Bennett is not a. Neither am I. Most I've had so many bad um, Sony cells that I won't use them, and I actively go and try and get rid of them. Uh, whether in Queensland, did I just start a fire? What? Can everyone just go away? All good. Can I give you a short call? Sure. Okay, I've got to call this guy. And all I've got to do is work out where my mic is. got a that that board is yep. married to the motherboard so I've got to replace the port is the audio jack physically damaged or is it just not working because you shorted out the port for the card reader I have to test the knowledge you know I, I thought that I, I didn't think you could actually I thought when you I mean, I've been watching the videos right yep. so um, for whatever reason I thought that it could only the audio jump would stop working until you started saying it. Yeah, it makes sense. So I'll test it. 
Yeah. I'll test it uh, and uh, I'll message you. Uh, what is your availability? Um, if you brought it in today, I could have it done today for you. I mean, it, it realistically is only an hour an, an hour or so job. It's not very difficult. It's just having the parts in stock, which I do. Um, but they are a common thing, and I've only got two um, ports left, and I've got another 30 on order. So my intention is to come to the evening after I drop my daughter off to the grandma. Yep. Where are you again, by the way? Um, so I'm in Forest Lake. Not too bad. Today would be great. That's all. I've got three teenagers. Just keep that <laughs> oh, mate, tell them to go outside and play. I've got no sympathy for the teenagers. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's why I'm, I'm in no rush. Yeah, no worries, dude. Okay, no worries. Get it over to me. I'll get it done. Just send me your address, please. I will do. Cheers, mate. See ya. Bye. Yes, Wayne, I'll see you in an hour and a half because I gather you're watching this. Rightio, so at least I have some jobs coming in. So we've got a switch, we've got, no, we haven't got the X anymore because that's in Wisconsin somewhere. Um, two Playstations and a, what was the other one? I can't remember, anyway, doesn't matter. Um, where are we at? I really need a drink. My mouth is dry. 68 people don't like me taking work calls. I'm on a live chat, but tough luck. Um, I have no idea where I'm up to. No idea at all. Can you stop messaging me? Oh no, that's the admin chat. Go away, admin chat. Um, heat translation, brand new car. <laughs> it's not a brand new car, it's 47 years old. 46 years old. Uh, shitload of sour. How rain already looking gloomy here, ran out of power. Um, head studs if they make them for a mini. Um, and today is dark. I'm still good at the moment. I don't think I'll get enough charge to cover tonight. This weather. What else have we got? I should just go to the bottom again. If I've missed if I've missed your messages again, you're just going to have to put it in again. Oh, we're up to th 3 minutes and 46 seconds. Get in. Uh, Corey, see you later, mate. Thanks very much for tuning in, and thank you for everything you do on the forum, buddy. It is much appreciated. Uh, I've got loads of 2,000 milliamp hour cells new. I need 200 more. I'm going to cost um, the right light to buy them. I have got used cells, but actually... Don't want to use them. What's your opinion on mixing new with old? If they're in separate packs that you can upgrade to new later, I'd do it. Do that. Or make a little, make a little bit that you can add onto the outside. But as long as the overall capacity is the same, it's not ideal, but it will work. Um. Uh, just in time. No oh, station. How are you, man? It's been a while. Um, I'm not buggering off. I'm going to just sit here and I'm going to do work and I'm just going to leave the live feed on if I've got customers here. Um, I'll just turn the audio off. I don't think I'd get the, the GoPro around to the other computer desk. And the camera is USB 3 and I don't have any USB 3 extension cords. Uh, show... Smart ass, are you in the States? Um, there we go. That's not directed to me. Or maybe I should go and have a look. Molly cells, Molly cells. I wish Pete was closer, damn it. 1,400 kilometers south of me. Oh, that's just a hop, skip, and a jump. Shit, you could do that in one day with about six Red Bulls and um, some chocolate cake. Um, pending, Wayne, random fireworks, I don't know why people are saying random fireworks, 
I should have shared this on Facebook. Are there any functional downsides to having one cell with 20% more capacity than the others? Yes, microcycling. I think they proved that wrong, but anyway. Um, where are we? I've lost the chat. I wander off and look at something else and then I get lost. Smash that like button. Absolutely. Um, like UK, smart as. John, thank you very much for the emoji bomb. Um, Sam S, never mind, from Finland. I've been meaning to solder up a 5 meter USB cable using plugs and cable from JCAR and the like. Um, off for, why not with my sleep disorder, Pete? I don't have a sleep disorder, I just don't sleep very much. I, I wake up and then I start stressing or I start thinking. And on that note, I'm going to go and grab a drink and I'll be back. I'm going to fill up my bottle and then grab some Coke. And I'm going to see if the wife has any snacks because snacks are a really important part of my life at the moment. I wonder if I can make this this um, live feed private whilst I'm in the live feed so that way the people that are here can just chill out and have a chat RIP headphone users why would I do Double O double five three six nine three six nine. Um, <laughs> Peter's brain likes thinking as much as he likes to math. Shut up, Wayne. Get in the car and come for a drive. Come and get your bloody shrink wraps. There we go. That looks like a customer. Um. $2 a piece for laptop batteries. Bloody hell, that's dear. Oh, is that for a whole laptop battery? Now, when the customer comes, I'm just going to have to turn the, the camera off. Like, I'll leave the camera on, but I've got to turn the microphone off. Um, phone message, beep. No, it didn't beep. Audio jack works fine. Okay, cool. Um, four core cable in the store, thick enough cable and shielded phone message beep. Uh, as the phone message didn't go beep. Funny, no battery. I can move that out of the way if you like. I can just sort of, we can just leave some black space down the bottom. Make it slightly bigger. There we go. Now we've got no battery. The battery, the, the no battery is referring to in the GoPro because I got the GoPro with the media mod and then into a capture card on my computer. So that's what the no battery is. And you take the battery out and then you turn the power settings to always on on the GoPro. But if you leave the battery in, it goes really hot. So that's why there's no battery in it. Makes sense kind of when you know, doesn't it? I like the irony of having no battery there, so we'll put it back. 
Um, I can't watch stream and drive. You don't need to. It's the same shit on repeat. You can watch any old live stream and it's exactly the same as this one. <laughs> uh, what do we got? That one, not that one, that one. We've got 3 minutes and 57 seconds. Average watch time. Oh, 56 seconds. We're getting up there. But we're, we're losing people. We had 70. And we've only got 55. But it's the quality of the people that matter, right? Um, That lolly water is not a good snack. If you'd be better off snacking on wifey. <laughs> yeah, right. If I want to get my head bitten off with blunt teeth if you ha actually if you got like a the side of a a butter knife and this just started hacking that's what it'd kind of be like uh, uh what are you doing for your day job so blur the top left <laughs> um so day job is computers consoles laptops things like that fine i'll go then I might actually even be on live feed when you get here, Wayne, and then you can you can say, "Hey, look, I'm Wayne." <sighs> Just walk by and accidentally drop a few sanyos. That's what the admin chat is at the moment. Jesus balls. Um, and that mustn't have been a customer because they drove past slowly and had a look but didn't stop. Ah, uh, blur the top left. Fine, I'll go. What else, what else is happening? Who else is in the room? Chat with me, damn it. It's probably because I keep not chatting. I've drunk so much water, I'm going to have to pee soon. <laughs> pee before the customer gets here. Ding, ding, ding. Um, just, how, do I, how do I manage to do that? Can current viewers, what else we got? Oh, you got chat rate, you got playbacks. There we go. Um, da, 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 da. Where's the chat gone? There it is. Ah, and now it keeps. Um, keep out of the way of wifey. That actually works really well. Uh, got any new pictures of the solar panels on the roof? No, Dave's tech. I can't change anything on the roof. And that's one of, the, one of the problems I have with doing stuff lately is I can't change anything because as soon as I change everything, I've got to bring everything to the current um, Australian standards, which doesn't work. Oh my God, the k -well is amazing. I had to get it as the welder was just as unreliable. Yeah, unfortunately, they work. Microwave transformer, they, um, they work. But you can't get the reliability, the stability on anything else that I've used other than the K-Weld. Although the Sunco 709AD was a really good spot welder as well, but that died. What? Where is um, Rowan? I think that died after probably 10,000 welds. That'll be another phone call. Put you on mute. Sure, drop it in, we'll get it done. I'm open till 5 today. So just, re what was the problem with it? It was PlayStation 3 with, um... Waiting, but for the laser. The diagnostics, maybe the laser. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Thing, so. yeah. Um, while I've got you two, um, I know that the current machine I have doesn't have the capability of playing the previous um, games. I know there was a model that came out that could play both the PS2 and PS3. Yep. So, um, discs? No, no, you can't upgrade it. That's a, that's a, that's, that, that, there's two problems with that. You need a really old version that hasn't ever been on the internet because if you've upgraded past version 4. Point, oh, 4. Point, don't quote me, 3.4 or 4.3 or something like that, they removed the ability and that's only on a PS3 60 gig. So it's got, it's got four USB ports at the front and it's got a card reader on it. 
which none of the others had. They were two USB ports and no card reader. Yeah, and that was kind of, it looked a bit different. It had a bit of a metallic finish to it. Well, oh, I, think, I can't yeah. remember the finish, but I know, I know the specification and stuff. But that's the only one that does it. I have four or yeah. five of them, but I, yeah. was, I'm never, ever selling them. <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah, well, with warranty stickers on them, they're, they're, and the box, they're worth. Uh, you get true. that, you get thousands for them. Yeah, true, so, true. Yeah. Yeah, cool. So that's all right. Um, well, I'll do that. I'll bring it around. Um, is it over? Is it in Johnston Place? Is it the address? Yep. Yep. Cool. All right. Well, I'm over at West End, so I'll just make my way out to the Western Suburbs and stuff over there sometime this morning. Done. No worries, mate. Cheers. Cool. I've got the. Um, I've got the. I think all mine are dead. I got okay. I got like twenty of them, and, and the last one I worked on didn't work. But yeah, drop it in, we'll get it done. Yeah, cool. All right, mate. We'll see you in a little bit. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Bye. bye. Um. Okay. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back in a second. I got a customer. <laughs> oh, I'm on live feed. That's all right. Do you need cords? No. Give me a second, guys. Got to turn the microphone off. Talk among yourselves. Don't say boobs.
Oh yeah, I'm back. That's one at least. What's the bet? It's just a power supply. What is that? Silverstone. ES230 power supply. That's not opening. No, I'll just wreck the box. What's the bet? It's power supply. I reckon it's the power supply. It's always the power supply. Well, it's not always the power supply. Um, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Is live streaming a workbench? Yes. Yes, it's an exciting workbench. Yes, thank you. One uh, instantaneous current required. I uh, tried to follow what HP was doing when I was in Darwin, Australia. Now I'm in Canberra warehouse. Awesome. Alan, that sounds good. <laughs> it sounds like a good, decent supply. Um, pretty sure they went 4S4P. Um, all be in half server cabinet on wheels. I don't know what that is. TWM22. Into um, the 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 K world. That's what um 18650 shrink does. Is the K world. He sells the K world in North America. He's the North American distributor for them. Uh, guys, slow the world is sleepy. I'm using five S two P for that. Any time. See ya. Thanks, Keith. Headway holders, um, where do you buy your cells from? Community. What's better, old laptop cells? I'm guessing the packs are older. The batteries come from semi new scooters. Scooters will be high drain, and they're typically not as old, but they've probably had some pretty hard life, I reckon. I'm lucky I'm in IT disposal, so get all my stuff free or very cheap. Alan, that is freaking awesome. 50% is the power supply, uh, Chinese capacitors, good quality, reliable, no leaking, pure nickel. Pure nickel is the key. And lithium solar is back. Oh yeah. I caught up. Usually I get a bunch of phone calls in the morning for jobs and then it sort of peters out through the day. And then usually half of the people that call up about a job actually show up. So, holy heck, this thing's full of dust. It's like really full of dust. Ooh. If I move the other can, there we go. Right, I'm going to show you a trick. Oh my goodness, look at that video card. You open up some of these and it's like archaeology. Oh yeah. I'm going to show you a trick. This is Ryobi. Look, nine amp hours. I wonder if you can hear it. Actually, that's what I was going to do on the thing. Right yeah. Okay, yeah, they're both charged. Ryobi. <laughs> Come on. Hey, how's your ears, guys? I don't know if you can hear that on camera. And the bloody phone's going. Yeah, no worries. Just give me a call before you head over. Actually, no, give me a call. Give me a call a couple of days ahead of time before you head over. <sighs> yeah, no worries. I appreciate the call, mate. Um, and I'll see you whenever you're here. It's, it's not really hard. I, I, you know, I don't make it easy deliberately.
Done. Cheers, mate. See ya. Oh, smash that like button. No. <laughs> no. Thanks, mate. I do appreciate it, bud. Cheers, bye. Somebody found my phone number. Um, I don't. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear that or not, but the, you can hear the difference in the Ryobi um, for the like the amount of power and 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 what it's blowing, you know, how much airflow it's blowing. So, anyways, righty ho. I assure you, I really have to work, so I am going to try and work and. If I turn that monitor around, I can watch the chat as well. Headphone users. <laughs> no, you never use a vacuum cleaner because you hit the vacuum cleaner in there and so many people knock components off the motherboard. No, do not use a vacuum cleaner first. Never use a vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner is a stupid idea with a computer. If it's your only um, way of doing it, do it but and always turn it on at wall because that really makes you look more professional okay so that's not working whoever built this is a shit everything's zip tied up I oh, know it's not even zip tied thermal master power supply geez we're upgrading the power supply too um answer the phone with a <laughs> um, PS4 shell. Mm, I've probably got second-hand ones and stuff lying around. Um, it depends on, it depends on the model. Ooh, I'd have to strip one out. I've only got PS4 Pros complete. Oh, no, I've got a couple pulled down. Um, what, what part do you need? Oh, okay. I, I've never been asked for that. I'd have to, I'd have to Google's it and work out how much that's worth. Um, what happened to yours out of interest? You want a PlayStation? So you so you just want a gutted one just to uh, to mess with somebody's head? I can't I look. I kind of like that. Wait a minute. I'm I'm on a YouTube live feed at the moment. I'll ask all my, all my 68 people in my room. Should should I give this guy a PS4 Pro? empty just so we can prank his friends who's it who's it for wait a minute i'm gonna put you on speaker who's it for oh, it's, um, it's for my dad because uh, I, he um takes the playstation every uh during the town school time so instead of giving him the actual playstation i thought of just giving him a shell oh that's that's sneaky yeah so instead of giving him the real, so he, so so this is so you can't play the console. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, I I thought it was actually a prank, but that's just des, de, devious. Um, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll sell it to you, but what's it? I'll have to work out what it's worth. I'll, I'll have to I'll have to jump on. I'll, I'll keep your number and I'll um. <laughs> some some of my some of my members said you've got to put a brick in it or something so you get don't get fooled by the weight. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, we will work something out. I'll give you a call back. I've got I've got to, I've got to see what I've got. Sure. Thank you. Okay, cheers, mate. Okay, so that's a first. <laughs> Seriously. So I don't know if you heard that or not, but he wants. A PlayStation, an a, a PS4 Pro, so he can give it to his dad. So, when the when school goes back, he can keep his PlayStation. I think it's genius. I really think it's genius. But as a parent, I'm just sitting. As a parent, I'm sitting here thinking, 
oh, I can't do that to them. <laughs> um, someone's selling a PS4. I know, some, heaps of people are selling the, the, the box. No, no, no. <laughs> Give it to him. I would have given it to him if it was playing a prank on his buddy. But if he's trying to trick his old man, he can pay for it. And he can pay properly for it. <laughs> um... Joining the, I'm not joining the. I'm not. I'm not a scammer. I'm. I'm a businessman earning money. <laughs> I, I think it's genius. Uh, give it to him. Put some busted PC parts in there. <laughs> uh, sneaky bastard. Held for a review. Oh, that can that can go through. What happened to that? You can let that through. I don't know where it went. Um. Johnny's, give it to him. <laughs> I was thinking, about, and they did, a, did approve that. I only been an electronics technician for 35 years. What do I know? I suppose we should blow out laser printers too. Sorry, disagree. I just, I know, I know customers have gotten there and 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 suck shit out. And I'm lucky. Look, I'm lucky. I'm in a workshop. I'm in a shed. I'm not inside the house. I'm not in an office, so the dust doesn't worry me. Blowing it out with a leaf blower, I promise you, it's the quickest thing you can do, and I guarantee you I do it with laser printers as well. But not from close up, but it still gets a lot of the loose um, dust and stuff out from the when the the trash bin overfills in the laser cartridges. Um, some bricks in it and uh, should put some bricks in it and sell them on AliExpress, it would still be better than some of the stuff you purchased there. Uh, don't blow out laser printers. I always have blown out laser printers, but I've never had any problems. How's the mini going? It's getting there very, very slowly. Radio. I gotta work out what I'm gonna do with this guy. I need to goog I need to um, work out what it's worth on eBay because I can't just get the case. It's got to be the entire shell, and the shells are worth money to me because customers drop them, and. Um, what new cases put on. So that's like a $150 job to me. So technically speaking, I'd lose $150 doing that. Okay, we got fan spin. As Lewis Rosman would say, we have fan spin, which means she's working, which is all we need. Invoice that up and send it back out to her. Well, first of all, I have to put the power supply in. Can't breathe laser dust. Now you probably shouldn't breathe laser dust. I um I've got ten kilos of um I fill up my own toners for my laser printers. I've got ten kilos of powder underneath the desk, and yes, it, it's got to be carcinogenic for sure. Uh, well, we have a damn experience with super dry for air for blowing out. I told them no point to super dry. If the whole workshop gets filled with dust, yeah, <laughs> yes, uh, it's just a computer. Uh, what is that thing? Desktop computer with a bad PSU. That's all it was. And anybody that was here earlier, no, I picked the fault over the phone. Not like it was a very difficult fault though. But get in. Um, looks dangerous. Best to blow. Best to throw it in the bin. <laughs> Uh, and I hope you all learned something. Thank you very much for tuning in. I'll see you on the next one. No, don't go. When will people learn what a vacuum is? A blowjob device for teenagers? I can't actually say that on a live feed. Scratch that. Um, he'll pay 150 then <laughs> pinch it off the old man. What do you reckon that's true? I've got to do something, but I do have, I do have one pulled apart. PS4 Pro, right. So even the fans in a PS4 Pro were worth money. The heat sink's not. That's the cases. That would be if it got dropped. I mean, how much is he going to need in here to pull this off? And I don't have a broken power supply. 
I sold all my broken power supplies off. Um, <laughs> being defunded. <laughs> um, it's really hot in here. I've got to turn a fan on. He'll pay 150. Uh, number one, have you turned it off and then turn it on again? Uh, just actually, that's what I got to do. Work out his phone. I got to keep his phone number. It's a problem. You get you get talking and then you forget to. Was it 10:06? Yeah, that's it. That's him. Right out. Yeah, got his phone number. So if I just give him that. I'm not going to give him any cables because all of these cables are good to keep. And I can't get that one out because I've got to pull that out to get the Wi-Fi board out. So that one can stay there. Look at that. Whatever it. See, that's got no board in it. That's going to be obvious as. There's no power supply, no board. And it's significantly lighter without all that stuff. I did this once with all my PlayStation 3s. Someone broke in and stole a whole heap of stuff and it was all empty, um, it was all empty PlayStations. And I just pissed myself laughing. They would have got it all home, plugged it in, and nothing worked. That is significantly lighter. And there's not even any USB ports in the front. Because, you know, this is supposed to be a battery chat. What do we got? Come on, grams. Because all of these are in Australia. So that's 1.28 kilos for a PlayStation 4 Pro. And an almost complete one, because you can see that. You can see exactly, oh geez, that, that thing is getting hot. Um, so that's 1.28. And that's more than two kilo, that's only a two kilo thing, so it actually goes over, so I can't even weigh it. I'm sorry, the dad would have to be, the, the dad would have to be a proper, proper idiot not to know what was going on there. I mean, if you put it in a box and whatever, he might pull it off, but what do you reckon? We need a vote. To let, do we do it or not? I'd charge him a hundred bucks or something for it, which is not worth it. But I guess it's worth it to him if he pays it. Ah, the dilemmas. What do you do? I like doing the ethical thing. Um, Who is the guy talking? He's interrupting our chat. I do apologise about that. <laughs> Look at that Ryobi colour. Imagine painting a car that colour. Um, who even wants a PS4 these days? All those that have sh got the shits with the play Xbox. Um, paint doesn't exist. Just have to do two layers thing. And it's makes so I'm still rocking an Xbox 360, just hot glue a motherboard inside, PC motherboard inside. Still rocking a Dreamcast. I'm scared to get rid of that thing. Um, the American folk, thank you very much for that very kind conversion. I can't think in a single bit less than uh, empty case weight. Any progress on the mini? A little bits of progress on the mini, not much. And my screen's not turning on. Excellent. That's just what I need. Okay, so that's got... I should get this one finished anyway. Actually, I've got to drop that back, so I can't drop that back till later on this afternoon. So that can, that can actually wait. Um, funny i'll be up there shortly i'll be up there shortly for a playstation repair how long ago was that 
How long have we been on live feed? Two hours. She said she would be in here in half an hour, and it's an hour. That seems to be the way it goes. It's getting really hot in here, so I'm going to have to turn a fan on, which may annoy the shit out of this microphone. I might move the microphone over this side a little bit closer. I might... Sorry about your ears again. Uh, I should mute it before I go tap, tap, tap on the camera. Uh, we'll turn that down a little bit. That probably turned it down too much. <laughs> yes, the mini should be Ryobi green. <laughs> uh, so have we talked about solid state batteries before I got here? No, it probably won't after you've arrived. Uh, Ethereum is up. Yes, I, I've been changing. I've got two Ethereum. Well, I had two Ethereum coins and I've been going in between uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum backwards and forwards in my wallet. And I think I've made like $500 in the last two weeks. Just from doing that. That's a bit better. Pete's new at doing videos. Yeah, I don't interwebs much. Um, uh, the mini should be right over green. Probably, honestly, I just assume that we're waiting for the rest of the regular solar cell companies before from the public. I haven't even heard of that. I'll have to Google it later. I'm actually kind of nervous and contributing to Plenum Energy. Oh, so my power the meters to any project terrifying in a way. 502 weeks and battery hasher is dead. That's not battery hashing. That's taking the funds from battery hashing. <laughs> but mining with mining with batteries is crazy. I had I've got two of those cards left I had in the battery hasher. And it smashes the battery so hard that it ends up costing you more money because you've got to pull from the grid anyway. And you've got to pull from the grid at night time. So it's, it's just not worth it. You'd have, to have, you'd have to have a pretty reasonable setup. So just run 500 watt rig. You've got to have a lot of solar panels and a big battery to do that. Like, say you've got a couple of days of autonomousness if you've got, like, cloud and stuff. Yeah. So... You'd never get return on investment. Maybe, what, 14 months ago when Ethereum was at 1800 and difficulty was a lot lower? But record high difficulty, record high, um, what do you call it? Well, no, it's not record high. It's got good prices, but it's not record high. That camera is so hot. I just cleaned you off. So now you haven't got a big thumbprint smudging it up. Uh, lots of videos on YouTube. Cheers, Pete. Got to go keep up the good work. Got another customer coming in, so I'm going to have to turn the camera off. No, not turn the camera off. Turn the audio off again. Um, watch time, 4 minutes and 23 seconds. The watch time's going up, guys. It must be all used lot hanging around, so I appreciate that. Oh, I've got the monetization off again. You've got to be kidding me. Oh my god, YouTube, why don't you leave monetization on by um, by default? I hate you.
Okay, I've just got to get this done. I'm not going anywhere, but I was here rather than over there. Need a magnet. Oh yeah, boards out. HDMI port.
need some water. When do the new t-shirts come out? I don't know, t-shirts only sell one, I think I only sold three last financial year. Anyone know anything about them you used? Well, it's getting late, I'm off, so yeah. Analytics, go back to analytics. I'm sorry, I'm sorry I'm neglecting you, but I have to get this done. Uh, there's one track ripped off the board by the look of it. The track's fine.
I stop. Green tweezers. Oh yeah, one HDMI port done. Question is, is it going to work? That's always the question. These slim boards are the easiest boards to do. And a very little thermal mass to the motherboard, thermal mass.
Got it. Will it work? I'm not making money. I forgot to monetize the YouTubes. <laughs> oh, that didn't work. So there might be another problem with it. I have to revisit it. Put a, I can put a solid state hard drive in there or something like that, like a one terabyte solid state hard drive, which would make it a little bit faster. But you're really not going to notice very much at all. Yeah. Well, heat, I, I don't even know if they thermal throttle. I don't think the console's thermal throttle, but I think they just overheat and shut down. Have you ever got a shut down message or? Okay, is it really, really hot? There's a fan's wall when you're using it. Oh, okay. Um, 30 degrees is nothing. I mean, you, you want to get... Well, look, bring, bring it in. We'll have a look. We'll see what we can do for you, mate. We'll take it from there. Nothing, just drop it all in and I'll get it done. No worries. Cheers, I'm just going to stop this live feed. I'm um, do you want me to stop it or leave it running? Let me know. Leave it running or, or stop it. I hate when he's diagnosing. <laughs> with the lights in the car.
Well, the pads were funny for some reason, and... I do have a new port. Panicking that I didn't have a new port. You've got to be kidding me. but
It's still live feeding. Yeah, I, I, I was looking away. Well, this port doesn't want to play the game. Um. They've ripped out all the um, ripped the legs out of the motherboard. Oh, so it's like I'm trying to just 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 coax it back in again. They've actually ripped the, the two back legs, uh, the solder and all, and the and the, and the mounts in the in the in the motherboard. Well, is that HDMI port? Yeah. The problem was with that; it's not sitting flush on the board. Oh, if I drop the 50 people, mine's still going. <laughs> <laughs> the port of it at the back for collateral damage. Wrong tip. You hate when you get your wrong tip. Made good time. Yeah, surprisingly, there's no traffic coming down. Going back is going to be a nightmare. Northbound has just been horrible the last week and a half. Go and have a look in that box over there. There might be some heat shrinks in that one beside the 3D printer. Yep. Beside the computer. Uh, in the computer. underneath that yellow bag. Oh, white bag. Yeah. Uh, I bought you a present, sir. You bought me a present. Oh, Pepsi. Wayne was just in the live feed, but now Wayne's here. Wayne's still in the live feed. If I actually put it. I don't even know what I'm looking for. Are these like individual strips or? Yeah, it's a huge bag. They might also be under my feet. A lot of what? A lot of MC4 connectors. Okay, third time lucky. This gives you an idea of the stress that Pete's going through right now. Right here, microphone.
And the microphone's back on again now. Not in there? No. Other that, I'm going blind, which is quite possible. It's like a big packet. It's like a... Yeah, I thought it would be something fairly bulky. I actually, like, I've just ripped apart my entire shed and changed it all around. As you can see... Yes. Yes, I can, um, definitely. That'll be heat shrinking, that one. Yeah, that's a bit worse. You'll see it, and it's grey or blue. I'm not in notes. So it must be... What the fuck? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to put this back together. If, yeah. there, if it's not in there, slide that back over and it'll be in one of these three containers here. Has anybody seen my heat shrink? I don't think I lent it to anybody. Stay off camera. I don't know, probably. <laughs> <laughs> What's on your shirt? I can only please one person that stays up with me. I wear this for my wife every day. Excellent. Mm -hmm. I am so confident I'm going to attach the Wi Fi. people from all the way around the world can see him. Are we down to 14 now? Uh, 52. It's gone up. You can see the overwhelming response with, Pete's working, Pete's working, Pete's working. Is this going to work? Take two. And if you turn around the wall, you make it look more professional. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Bam. Orange light. And that's not looking good for my first live HDMI port repair. Timer, audio IT, excellent. Short on the board. Go and tell the customer. Uh, those. That one.
Yeah, you found some. Yep. Let me. I would have shorted out the board. Okay. Controller. Let's see if we've got communication. Okay, so we've got blue light on the controller, which means there's something else wrong with it, so I'm going to have to go through it and work it out. Um, no, it's not FUBAR, it's either HDMI encoder IC or filters. Yes, I think it's all been delivered. Um, this is, no, because it's all sold out again. Um, give me a second, I've just got every port out. I'm trying desperately to find stock because I'm running out of everything. Oh, USB C ports. Oh, I've got 40 in stock. No, the next lot come in. I've got, I've got USB C ports in stock. Yep, so nine to five weekdays, you drop it off. I get it done and give you a call and come pick it up. No, I don't know. Well, it, it wouldn't hurt to have the Joy Cons because sometimes you can't charge it again, so you've got to short out the board and do some weird stuff to get the Joy Cons to charge again. So probably bring the Joy Cons over, bring your charger just so I can verify your charge is working as well. Um, yeah, I'll get it done. Yeah, I've got, I've got the Nintendo Switch charger here as well, but it's um, I just want to make sure that yours is working, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Okay, done. Okay, cheers, mate. Thank you. Bye. Okay. I don't need any money. What is it? They cost you at some point in your life. <laughs> <laughs> no. Keith, did I pay for them or not? Here, Keith, I owe you twenty-five dollars. Okay, so that's not working. That sucks. Here you go. I'm going to go find a gig. Yeah. 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 How long does it take? You're in the north side, aren't you? Yeah. Halfway to Pipeca. That's a shitty drive for 12 from the heat string wraps. Uh, it also gets them out of the house to wipe sleeping cushions on night shifts. Ah, uh, okay, so that's... So, yeah, it's not it's, all bad. No, it was more about getting him out of the house so he doesn't annoy her. Yeah. Uh, I didn't take 550. Which colour did you take? Blue. Uh, yeah, the light blue, purpley, I don't know. Was there the brand, was the grey ones in there as well, just in case anybody else asks? I did not take any notice of any of that But there's still a, an absolute ton of those purple ones though. Yeah, 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 I haven't used too many of them. I don't think I'll be using very many of them in the future either. Well, I've just got a bunch of cells that were, you know, here that um, all the wrapping was completely buggered on them, but they're breeding like 28, 2900 money under. Oh, okay. Yeah, so they were keeping. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Sure. I think it was a e-bike. 
Did something that was out of? Or screwed at one of those. Oh, okay. Um, so they're fairly high drain cells. Yeah. You still getting lots of cells, or I know your 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 I'll supplier don't say so you supply your supplier is, is no longer available. It's no longer available. <laughs> um, so now I've got two boxes worth that I've got sitting there. Yeah. Um, so probably about 120 batteries, maybe. Yeah. Sitting there. Um, I'm because I, I already I give them straight back to him if they say no. Literally, we crack them open when he brings them around. Crack them open if they say no, they go straight back to him. <laughs> Take that shit back, brother. And, well, and, and then they go to the next person who collects them. <laughs> Same thing as if like I don't bother with drills or I, or um. Like drill batteries, or there's some good cells in drill batteries, but they take so long to get out. They, uh, for the most part, I don't have too much problems with the drill batteries, but 99.9% of the time is they've been hammered, yeah, and so they're just not really any good usually. Um, I'll take I'll take e-bikes and scooter ones. Pretty pretty hit and miss on those. Yeah. Uh, I've dropped off four. E bike batteries that were, that were 100 cells each. Yeah. No. Completely dead. Just. No, they were coming up as like 600 milliamp. No. They, they were well, they were from 2015, I think. So they, were, they, they didn't work hard for a while. I'm going to take a photograph of this port and I'm going to put it on, on the forum. It's really hard to get a good photo of a port where it's all shiny and reflective. Are you out here? See you buddy. Knuckles. Boom. Oh, he does exploding knuckles. Exploding knuckles? Yeah, so go between You gotta do five knuckles. you gotta do you gotta do thumbs knuckles. Do you want me to teach you how to do thumbs knuckle? You do this and you go. <laughs> we go home? No worries, Wayne. Good to see ya. Thanks for the drink. Yeah. That's okay. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. You can get back on the life easy when you're driving home again. It's still on. I'm <laughs> still sitting in the car running. <laughs> All right, I'll see you later. later. Cheers, mate. Damn it, all the filters are right, which means it's HDMI encoder I see, which I don't have in stock. <sighs> so I have to pull one off another board. Um, I really want to fix it now. It's driving me crazy.
so much. Right. What have we got?
Okay, so that's a PS3 Slim Nintendo Switch. And hasty my port that's going south on me. I really want to sit here and read audio streaming is weird I really want to sit here and chat to you all but got to run those K welds out of the post office be back in yeah I'm still feeding you I'm around but if anybody else is here just let everybody know that I'm actually working for a living Okay, power button's hit again. Let's try again. Hi, mate. How are you? Here's four prime. 
Uh, what have we got? Uh, I'll play the team and we'll like to stuff on the screen. Is it just the teams? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I got stuff to do, I promise you. Okay, take four didn't work.
So you're the fifth one in today, and I'm still on the first. Well, we'll just write on the call about the next day's coming in order. Or the next day's weekend, so that one's weekends. I'll give it a crack, I'll see if I can get one today. Oh, okay. PlayStation Pro. I actually have that. Wait a minute. Um, 192.168.0.177? 3? Hey, yep. seven two. Oh, you totally rearranged. My cameras aren't working. Yeah. So, so I can't do that. Sorry, I got another, 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 another YouTube here. Oh, I might be. I, I don't need all of it back. Yeah. Done. Oh, you done? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. Yep. Um, one of the. Oh, you doing? You still doing that? Oh, no. Are you still doing that? <laughs> No, yeah. I wanted to see that. I uh, seen that mission because I was watching it. Oh, so okay. I seen mission, I'm like, let's see how live this is, and it was like probably five second delay or something like that. Before Four I was second, before you before I saw it pop up on your phone because I saw your phone on the camera. Oh, okay. I'm, like, I'm gonna send a message say I'll come around <laughs> and see if it, it comes yeah, it's, up. It's pretty quick. It's like, pretty quick. The video is okay. The audio is usually like lags. Ah, right. Okay. So yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, man. All done. Uh, one of the uh, when I've finished, I'll donate for you and all that. Another one of the ports on one of those testers is is failing. Oh yeah. You know where one was already dead. Yeah. The second one now it overcharges cells. Oh okay. So it pumps it to like five volts or something like that. Don't say that about my opuses. Which one? Uh, the one that already had the one failed one on it. it said old on it, I think. Oh, okay. Oh, that's 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 one of my first ones. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, this one here, that one there. That one's that one's toast. Okay, we just gotta get a sharpie or something. And I'm just I'm doing a few more tests with mine, and then I'll give you one of mine. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't matter. Not too many people borrow it for stuff, you know, for the, for the community, you know, all that kind of stuff. If you uh, my install. Yeah, so my dad's totally off grid. Oh, okay. Uh, up in the rainforest, the installed thing there. there oh, go. look at that blues! Turn around, show everybody. Yeah, the camera's there. Camera's there. There we go. That's blue. Blue. And I think my mounts as well. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, man. Yep. And there's the there's the BMS system with the, the monitoring stuff that he oh, gets nice. to. That he gets to watch oh, it all. Oh, that's a DIY BMS. Yeah, 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 yeah. Built it all myself. Like it's all yeah. interwebs, and I don't know how to do this, but yeah, we'll see. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, anyway, awesome. All right. I'll let you let you do your thing. Yeah. What else you doing there? Just bought one of those. Oh, I just took that out of my son's computer because he needed to go. He got an AMD processor. Oh yeah. And a single's just, just. I can't keep it cool enough. Just can't keep it cool. Yeah, thermal throttles constantly. 
Yeah. So I had to get a triple and even a triple in and he turned the settings up. Yeah. And it still turned me apart the one. Really? Yeah. So yeah. he's playing with it, I think. So I think I'm, I think I'm in a FedEx. Like he's got a fancy case, not a good case. Ah, ah it looks good, but it doesn't It looks good, well, but it doesn't feel well. Yeah, so yeah, I might, yeah, right. I might yeah. change the case out. Yeah. And he's got an RX 580 in there, 8 gig. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah. And oh, this is my old ones out of my mining rig. Oh, yeah, you had that, <laughs> you had that thing all lined up. Yeah. It? So. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway. Yeah, nice. All right, well, have fun. How your bees going? Uh, one's dead. One bee, but one of the ones, that, the one on this side's dead. Yeah. The one on that side, I just took all the boxes off and just put them on top of the other one. Yeah. Oh, I lost three, two hives over that, over the break. Yeah. I think this, I think the one on this side, I think the one with the flow hive, I think that swarmed. And I dropped half the bee numbers. Yep. And yeah, then yeah. they're cranking again now, but they've got like six boxes or something. Yeah, lots of room. Oh, yeah, it's plenty lots of room. Of and then I'll split, but then I got the three out of the farm, they're all going gangbusters. Oh, yeah, good. So yep. that's probably tomorrow I go out to the farm. This lot want a bloody video. Um, Probably go to the farm tomorrow, and I'm just going to shake all those things out. Yeah. Because they're all just just a dead eye. Just yeah, okay. basically, I just let them die. Yeah. Um, rather than because they're angry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, get rid of that genetic line down there. Yeah. yeah, but the problem is it's got all the drone broods. I'm thinking, geez, those those drones probably get and they're flying around. The, the drones, the males don't. It's the female side does the aggression. I can see his reason, doesn't it? Really funny. <laughs> yeah, I read that, I'm like, that's, that's hilarious. So yeah. the, ma the males d don't contribute to the aggression side of the oh, okay. it's always the females. Oh, okay. So the males are lazy and slow. But all of, it's funny, all, all of the bees out of the farm are all split from here and they're calm ants. They must have yeah. bred, but there was no drones out there. I didn't take any drones. Yeah, right, okay. Yep. And they so they must have mated with the what, two wild, uh, there's two wild hives out there in trees. Yep, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, Generally, the, the most uh, diversity you can get from a drone thing, the better. Yeah. When a queen mates so. Yeah, well, there's no, well, there's actually, there's like 30 hives in Forest Lake. So yeah, there'd be some, so there'd be some, some genetics floating around. Yeah, yeah, there would be. So, but my other, my, the guy I bought the hives off, he was saying that you can get a month of angry bees and yeah. then a month of good bees. Oh, I have Because had that. The, the queen mates with multiple drones. Yeah, that's just about 20. Ideal, yeah. yeah, but that discounts your your women. No, it's enough. supposed to be what I read, but yeah. maybe maybe, was, maybe maybe was someone trying to be funny. Maybe. <laughs> when you do, when you finish that piece, yeah. What? The, the, I haven't touched it. it. Oh, I've got well. I'm that's why I want the X6 I'm for. for the video. <laughs> well, the X6. I need to test this battery. Well, not the Ryobi one, the knockoff one. Yeah. So I want to. I'm just going to solder balance leads onto it and just cycle it. Because I can hit that with 30 amps if yeah, I really want. They're hard, high discharge ones in there. Well, I hope so. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. But I can, I can regen backwards and forwards to that. Yeah, yeah. So I should be able to get a couple of cycles of done a day. Yeah. But I've also got one cell in that yeah. that's at 1.7 volts. I, test, I tested, tested them all yesterday. Wait, the whole row? Whole 191 cells. What? Yeah. Why? Must have a self discharging cell in there. Oh, so it's just been sitting there for months. Right. Okay. So all yeah, of them yeah, are yeah. all of them are at three point seven volts except for one that's at two point uh, one point seven volts. And one cell would have killed it. Yeah, one, one cell, cell yeah. dragged it down. Well see if it was more I reckon if it was more than one cell it would have gone down way faster. But it's also yeah. it's also linear. It'll go down faster from two point four to say three yeah. than it will go from three to one. Because it's ah, less course. charge in the batteries, yes, 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 yeah, yeah, the yeah. less heat, less power. Yep. So it slows the discharging slows down as it gets lower and lower. Right. So yeah. So how do you then diagnose that? You well, that's going to be the video. Ah, okay. I think that'll be a really good video to say, okay, so I've got 191 cells with nickel strip on it. How do you find it? How do you find it? So one, you can charge it all the way up and throw, say, alcohol on it. You could wipe pure alcohol. Yeah across all the bus bars and wherever it's hot it'll evaporate quicker yeah because that one cell that should be over yep. the previous yep. video you could with your heat thing you could see there's the bad cell yeah but it's but, a, but with such a large number you can't get enough amps in there well, to get it to go hot 
Well, if you discharge the 30 amp for three hours, oh, she right. warms up. Right, yeah. Okay. So yep. that, that'll be one way of doing it. Um, another is to get a little bit of this and a cotton bud and just dab it on each one and see which one dries fastest yep. rather than just wiping it on. Yep. Um, also, you can look physical. You can look at the, the you look for a, a physical fault. Yeah, right, like something just yeah. expanded or something like that. Because I've got to do, I've got to do the video so uh, in, in a way that other people can do it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, yeah, you don't have... You don't have a thermal camera. Thermal camera. I look at those and like... Yeah. yeah. Well, I, see, I've got mine for 100 bucks on eBay. I just waited a lot. A lot yeah, I looked yeah, for a year yeah, or something. Yeah. Um, but then I'll use the thermal camera. Then you can um, use the, the, the temp gun as well. Yeah, yeah. So there's lots of ways you can do it. Yeah. And I'm hoping that the video will be that I can do that and not... Um, and actually find the fault yeah. rather than with having to pull it all off because the problem with pulling all the nickel strip off right. the K-Weld is the K-Weld does such a good job soldering that it just rips holes in all the cells oh, yeah, I know. you told me you ripped them all off and, you and lost a hundred cells yeah. yeah and I guess that's a problem with um, the pros and cons versus nickel strip yeah. and soldering up and then how do I fix it do I do I do I cut the cell out or do I just snip the wire and just let it sit there because I'm not going to notice one cell over 191 cells. No, you would have to pull them, charge it all up, pull it off, and then test every single one. Yeah. After two or three weeks or something. Well, no, you, you, literally it only takes a day. Oh, it, yeah, it, it takes an hour for the voltage difference because that cell's faulty. So it's well, it not drop hold, that quickly. Well, on a true heater, it doesn't hold any energy. It's 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 effectively a dead short. Oh, so with high you, resistance. If you jam that, charge it. Get, let's say it gets to 3.7 volts and then you rip off all the, you all the feel like strip. A, heat, a heater straight away well you can feel the heat but if it's not heating and it's you can get a heater without self you can get a self discharging without heat it's just doing it really slow so oh. what i reckon i've done is i've missed a cell yep. that's got a hole in it or something so it's dry oh, oh did that dry out i'm yeah. wondering what happened when yeah made. so and that's not that's that's not ideal either so that's I think that's actually a really good video. It is, yeah, yeah it's not trying to fix. That's good because I'll. I'll it's a, it's a, it's a genuine, it's a proper troubleshooting one. Yeah, yeah. yeah and it. I've also got two down there that are that are self discharging, and I've also got um, the bottom, the second one from the bottom right, left, yeah. is self discharging as well. But it does it does happen a bit more. Yeah, hey, of course it does. Yeah. See, those cells there are all like. They're all the ones that I've taken out, ripped the bus bars off, and resoldered. Oh, so right. they're all, they are bird life. Oh, right. So they're, they're the, the cells that are so low that I wouldn't have used them in my house battery. Oh, right. Okay, so they're super, super, super old. Yeah, they're, they're really, and in fact, I think that battery's only got about six and a half um, kilowatt hours. Right, all of, all of that. Yeah, my, mine ended up being about five kilowatts, 5.5 kilowatts for just one. Yeah, yeah that's, what, that's what I got. Well, that's what I got for the very first test. Yeah. I got four kilowatt hours at 1,000 watts, and then I got another kilowatt hour at 100 watts. So that's, ah, right. the, so I got five kilowatt hours charged. from one battery. Yep. So that's how I always worked out my capacity. Yeah. And even the newer ones are much higher capacity. Yeah, mine are Because they're better cells. 2.5 to 2.9, I think, the cells that I bought off you. Yeah. That should have been all pretty good ones. Yeah, they're really good. Yeah. yeah, I've still got... They're all the pink ones, eh? Uh, yeah, pink and a couple of the green ones. Yeah, so oh, those green ones are 3,000. Yeah, they were really good. I didn't use a lot of a lot of those because most were in the 2.5, 2.6, 2.7. Oh, okay. Um, I used some of them. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it worked out. They're all about 195, like with one or two and a half hours difference, mm. which is probably like... That's pretty good. That, that, that X6 is that. a beast, isn't Mate, it? it was awesome. You yeah. need a new fan, though. I was looking at another going, one. Jesus. Yeah, that thing is like oh, you can hear that thing moaning. <laughs> I've got an, I've got another fan around here for it somewhere, yeah. but it just it just keeps it just keeps right, dying. It's, it's such a good little unit that thing. It's yeah. so good. I love it. I wish I knew how to like design the 3D printing stuff. I'd I'd do a um like an external mount. Oh yeah. So you just put a bigger fan in there yeah, and just yeah, yeah. slow yeah. the speed down a little bit. Yeah. Were you doing regenerative discharge? Yeah. 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 yeah that, I think if you did internal, it'd just kill it. Yeah, it's not. It's only 
five, amps, five or six amps, amps depending yeah, on the much. volts. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I was really getting into the smaller pack that I'd do at first. And yeah. But that's what's that? That's probably more than two years old then. Yeah, it's probably even three miles. years old. It's done, miles. Yeah, it's done all Rowan's packs. It's done all of my batteries two or three times. Yeah. People borrow it all the time, so. Yeah. We got fifty-one people listening to me talk shit. Yeah, I am very sorry about that. I'm not. I'm not even. I haven't even got the chat up. I'm very sorry, and I forgot to monetize it. Ugh. Oh, did yeah. Know. Three and a half hours of watch time. Oh, is that? <laughs> Didn't go for that long. Oh, anyway. It was good though. Cut over Dad's lithium. He has eight hundred um, amp hour lead acids that are about twelve years old. Wow. I've only got about two kilowatts of life in it. You know, solar disappears, and then by like 10, 12 o'clock, 24.1, 23.9, and then they just thin, drop, and they just plummet down. Yeah. And I ran for the first time off, off your cells, and it was awesome. So seven o'clock, we flipped over to lithium, and it used about a third the whole night, fridge running. Everything. He's got very low usage anyway. Yeah. You know, well, let's look at it. Let's look at it. The farm. He's got four kilowatt of panels. Um, and he's got, he's got probably 19, 19 or 20 kilowatt hours of batteries out there. And he keeps ringing me up and like the first time I took, because I guess. just go like this, like. Yeah, they hardly, hardly move. Hardly, hardly move yeah. But he's running air conditioners out there and stuff. He's got, yeah, he's got a little 1000 watt air conditioner, he just runs his air conditioner all night. Yeah. Uses 10, 20 kilowatt, like 10, 15 kilowatt hours and the battery's charged up again by lunchtime the next day. So good, but dad, dad's like, This is this is amazing. Like, yeah. it's, it's just so, it's gonna be good. So, I'm building another row and then doing what you've done. Well, separately clicking them on, I've built them so you can slide them together, yep, and then just putting like bus bars to join them back to the Oh, so you can just add, add capacity. Double capacity yeah. Cool, yep, so around nine, nine kilowatts, that's what we all up. Yeah, so yeah, it's pretty cool, man. It's, I mean, I had stuff. eight, I had at the farm, we had 880 amp hours of batteries lead. Yeah, which is like which is what I had here yeah. before I started on the lithium um, thing, yeah. and that was I was lucky to get four or five kilowatt hours a night out of it. Yeah, it's so there's such a fix, man. Yeah, you, you draw it out fast, it disappears. You jam it in fast, and, and the voltage and the voltage sag, and the and you, you draw too much, you can't get it up the next day. Like it, yeah, like when I was growing up, we used to you hit the batteries hard, and the generator would be on for two days straight trying to get. Well, that's how bad they were. Yeah. Anyway, it's, uh, he doesn't even have a generator out there now. He hasn't turned his generator on for two years. Sam, he hasn't turned it on in ages now, just because he got more panels. Yeah. Which is awesome. Before, I only had 1.5 kilowatts for 25 years before he ran the whole house. Yeah. But it's like, it's it's, it's like, you, you, you wouldn't have five lights, you wouldn't have two, four, six, eight, nine no. lights on. No. no, he's got like a couple of lights on, no microwave. Yeah. No dishwasher. No cop, probably no coffee machine. No coffee machine, nothing yeah. like that. No, it's gas. Only thing, the big draw was the music, the amp when he runs the music, um, or um, fridge. Yeah. Fridge is a constant. You need that, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, um, yeah, yeah. yeah. Anyways. All right, mate. Awesome. I think they're already bored. We've right. dropped the forty-eight. Yeah. Nah. I don't even know why I'm leaving it running, but <laughs> it'll be good to sit there and chat to them again later. But sorry, mate. Thank you very much. All right. Thanks for dropping that, mate. Yeah, yeah. No, I'll probably borrow it again once I, if I can, uh, when I've done the next next row, yeah. just the capacity test again. Um, See ya. You know where it is. Awesome. Enjoy your break. Happy New Year. Will do. Christmas. Thanks, man. I'll catch you later. <coughs> Who's still in the chat? Uh, held for review. <laughs> it's fake. Pete's weekly ad stream. <laughs> there shouldn't be any ads. I didn't put the turn the monetization on. Um,
You're at a park. Get off the fucking internet. You're driving, son. Just turned case supply to eight. <laughs> Tuck them on. Oh, yeah, I gotta. Do I keep? Okay, do I keep this live feed running or do I just turn it off? Because I really actually have to work. I got a computer. I got to put back together. I got PS3. I got the X PlayStation Four Pro. I got the Nintendo Switch, and I've got the Slim, which is kicking my ass. What do I do? Up to you. Well, I think I might just stop it just so I can concentrate and I don't feel bad or guilty. I'll start it again later. I'll just kick it back on. Yeah, I'll kick it back on later. Anyway, I'm going to get out of here. Cheers, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for sitting here, watching it, watching me work. I'll, I'll try and get a camera on that side so I can sort of put it down so you can actually see what I'm doing. Um... It's nice to listen and for someone to down under. <laughs> um, now nah, uh, the the slims apart, so I'm gonna have to. I I got another I got another board here, so I'll pull the I'll pull the um, HDMI encoder IC off this one and test it. But I, I've only got one left, so if I can't get it fixed with that, it's a no repair. They don't get charged for it, so they won't mind. Anyway, tubers, thanks very much.